Hello everyone. This is the first question of exercise 8.3 of R.D. Sharma and the question says that we have to solve the following quadratic equations. Now, in these following quadratic equations, the first and second part are already factorized. So we just have to put the value of x equals to 0. That means that x minus 4 equals to 0, x equals to 4 and x plus 2 equals to 0 that means x equals to minus 2. Similarly, 2x plus 3 equals to 0, x equals to minus 3 by 2 and 3x minus 7 equals to 0, x equals to 7 by 3. Now, in this part, as you know that the quadratic equation is always of the form ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0. Now, in this part, this c is missing. So in place of factorizing it, we will first of all take x common. Then inside the bracket there will be 4x plus 5 and equals to 0. So the values of x will be first value equals to x equals to 0. Because if we put x equals to 0, then this complete left hand side will be equals to 0 and right hand side is already 0. And the next will be 4x plus 5 equals to 0. So x equals to minus 5 by 4. Now, moving on to part 4. It is having this c also in the form of minus 2. So first of all, we will do the prime factorization of 9 and 2. This means 3 and 3 and this means that 2 and 1. So we have to arrange this 3, 3, 2 and 1 in such a manner that we get 3. So we can do like 3 2 times is 6 and 6 minus 3 is 3. So we can write this like 9x square minus 6 minus 3x minus 2 equals to 0. 9x square minus 6x plus 3x minus 2 equals to 0. We will take 3x common. Then it will be 3x minus 2 plus 1 common. 3x minus 2 equals to 0. So it will be. 3x minus 2, 3x plus 1 equals to 0. So first of all, we will put 3x minus 2 equals to 0. That means x equals to 2 by 3. And then we will put 3x plus 1 equals to 0. So x will be equals to minus 1 by 3. Now, in this fifth part, we will again factorize this. And this is 1x. So we'll arrange the prime factorization of 6 and 2 in such a manner that we'll get x. So this will be 6x square minus 6 can be written as 2 multiplied by 3 and 2 is already given. So we can write this like 2, 2 times 4 and 4 minus 3. That will give us 1. So 4 minus 3, x minus 2 equals to 0. 6x square minus 4x plus 3x minus 2 equals to 0. Now, 2x is common. In the bracket there will be 3x minus 2 plus 1 common. 3x minus 2 equals to 0. So now this will be, I am writing it here, 3x minus 2, 2x plus 1 equals to 0. So x will be equals to 2 by 3 and x will be equals to minus 1 by 2. The remaining parts will solve in the next video. For any queries or doubts, you can contact us through our YouTube channel or through our website that is www.truemaths.com. Rest of the description is given in the link below. Thank you.